hi guys welcome back to the channel so i said it on more than one occasion on social media you can never tell who is watching you so you have to be careful what you say and what you do because you can never tell sometimes even the individuals in the highest position they watch they watch what you're doing on social media. Today was the expo at the National Arena and Auntie Donna was there representing Miss Birdie. And she met her idol, who is Lisa Anna. She keep on a talk about all oh, Lisa Anna pretty and everything. Yeah, no, she pretty on the TV. But when you see her in person, trust me, she's even prettier. So I understand why you keep on emphasizing on how pretty she is, how beautiful she is. No, people... What she said is that Lisa Anna said to her that she's proud of her. She's proud of the fact that she's not answering people on social media. And you see, by her saying that statement right there, right there, she motivate Auntie Donna in continuing to do what she's doing. Because you see, when you hear something like that coming from an individual who you look up to, that alone will encourage you to continue doing what you're doing. Because you see, when you're sitting on and you have these people watching you, and when you can hear it out of one of them mouth to say that they are proud of you, it goes to show say, I know one and a two and a three times. She'll watch her, maybe she even watch her more than that. And people, when you hear AD talk about it, you could see that. She was surprised to hear that coming from Lisa Anna Moat. And that to me is a big deal. And you have to wonder, all the other individuals on social media, you have to wonder, can anybody in a position like Lisa Anna say that to them? Do you think a person like her would look at certain individual and say to them, I am proud of what you're doing. I am happy that you are not answering. Do you think that a person like her would even sit and listen to some of them at times? Maybe she will do it, but when you hear them are cuss out, you know. Do you think she will sit and just listen to, to her entire life with them behaving like that? And when you watch, and I hope that they learn, because you see what happened today? At that expo where she is representing Miss Birdie, she was there working for Miss Birdie. What caused that? Social media. She met Sharika, Lisa Anna, and to hear that coming from Lisa Anna Mouth, it goes to show that this lady, you have people in eye position, people of all category watching you and people of all category donating to you as you always say and sometimes a lot of them they do it you know when they do it they said okay let me donate to this person and let me see what is going to happen because a lot of people you donate to charities here in jamaica and you know for sure that your money just go in their pocket the money don't get to do anything so all heap of people they sit they watch this lady they watch what she's doing and they are proud of her to know that someone who is coming from nothing is doing all of that. I know that tonight, no matter when nobody wants to say to her, not even tonight, for the rest of, well, the week done, tomorrow, and for the rest of next week, no matter what anybody come and they say to her, it now go move her because those word, words coming from her, idol as she said has the person who she look up to those words alone will encourage her for the rest of the year to continue doing the good work that she's doing so i don't think we should have to worry about her right now coming on her platform and answering these people because when she hear that from lisa anna anytime if she think figure answer she'll go think and she'll say okay then one day if lisa watch her one day such and such a watch. She's not going to do it because she don't want, I don't think she would want to disappoint a person like that who she look up to so much. So people, please understand that 
anything you say on social media, what you do on social media, you can never tell who is watching you. It can be the person who, is, who you're going to work for come next year, your boss. It can be that person who you're going to spend the rest of your life with and how you behave, what you come, what you bring across will determine the type of relationship that you're going to have with these people. So please, at all times, it will be difficult. It is going to be hard because blood runs through everybody, body. But at all times, try your best as possible to deal with everything in a positive light. Try as best as possible when certain things happen to turn a blind eye, not to pretend, not to answer. Just pretend that you don't hear and continue with business as normal because whatever you do and say on social media can and will be all against you.